The former EPA administrator was my um, wonderful colleague and friend, Lisa Jackson. She was the first African American to head the EPA. She championed outreach to a broader range of Americans, especially low income and communities of color. Because let's face it, low income communities uh, struggle with a disproportionate amount of pollution than more affluent communities do, and that is still the case today. EPA currently has a female chief of staff, and the way EPA is set up, there's the administrator and then there's assistant administrators, and three of the key, key assistant administrators are women, 